And so we open the gates on the first week of April. Nature strokes its colourful paintbrush across the hedgerows as Churchill and Fermanagh Street is once again awash with bunting, burgers and bustle. Nature is restored. For all of the Zooms and the bar stool discussions on the demise of football, there's still one place putting its red hand up to say, football is fine. If Tinder did provincial champions, I'd be swiping right to Ulster. It's hardly surprising that Ulster has produced more All-Ireland winning teams than any other province. When they're scrapping for every ball, fighting for every kick out, and spilling blood in the springtime before the summer holiday camps of qualifiers and group stages further south, this wee pocket of passions and parades of all kinds of coloured controversies continues to drive the droves from Bally Buffet to Dalton Road and further every year. We're going to turn Copac Orange in a few weeks. The golden era of the early noughties inflated the following so much that the Ulster finals were forced to take place in the capital. And what's better than one Ulster final? Two. It's an all Ulster, all Ireland final for 2003. The GAA is synonymous with tradition, but up here, on days like today, there are customs that are more engraved in the soul than in the museums. The entrepreneurial locals, the previews, the who's got the weans, the diamond, the ruckus, roaring and replays, the rivalries, the icons and the almosts. However, it's not always been seen as this haven of hope for Gaelic football. I'll tell you, to describe today's football, do you know how I'd describe it? I'd call it puke football. I want nothing to do with that, to be quite honest. You know, I think it's a disgrace. They've achieved something absolutely rotten. And whether it be seen as adopted or assigned, a certain siege mentality tends to add to this combustible mise-en-scene. Oh, my God, it is not good for your heart. But still, it's a fire that everyone wants to see around. But it's great. We've had Ulster football at its very best. Here, it's more than just a game. There is faith going to be restored to the game of Gaelic football when it's played with passion and indeed with purpose. Here, football is fine.